Hello friends, welcome back to our kitchen. Today we are making two vegan butter recipes. They are plant-based, they are oil-free. One has soy, the other one does not. One has coconut, the other one does not. So to our first recipe, we have cauliflower here, which has been steamed. We have psyllium husks. We have soy milk here. You can use any plant-based milk. And here we have salt and turmeric. To our next recipe, we have water, warm water. We have finely shredded coconuts. And here we have corn flour, yellow corn flour to be precise. And here we have salt. So we'll begin with this recipe that contains the cauliflower. We have our blender here and we'll add everything to the blender. You want to blend this until very smooth. Psyllium husks here is our game changer. Turmeric is just to give color. And you can use a different plant-based milk. Also, you can add honey um, to sweeten it. Or you can just leave it like that. So the blender couldn't blend smoothly. I transferred this to my food processor and this is how it came out. I didn't have to add any milk or water. Here we have some silicone cups where I will transfer them because I would wish to uh, see them in this shape. So here I've transferred them and allow it to stay aside as we prepare the next one. So for this next recipe, um, what we'll be doing We've added our water in our sufuria, basically adding all ingredients, the shredded coconut, the corn flour, and the salt. And we'll allow this to simmer for like five minutes. So stir until it boils and then you simmer for five minutes so that the corn flour can thicken. Um, the corn flour may refuse to thicken depending on the type of the corn flour you're using so if it takes time to thicken you can add some like a tablespoon of corn flour and here i'm using yellow corn flour because yellow corn flour has uh, some sweet taste as compared to the white one so this is what you expect to see a thickness that resembles that of a pancake so this is how it's looking the water will have gone down a bit and once this is done Put them in a blender and blend thoroughly until it is very smooth and fine. So I've put mine in my food processor. If you have a high speed blender, this will work well. So this is how it's looking. It's very creamy and it is smelling nice, guys. You need to try this. It's actually my favorite of these two. So I'm pouring them in my silicone cups, muffin cups. And you'll allow this to cool because this one has come out of um, the fire. It's still um, removing the vapor. You allow it to cool and then you refrigerate for like an hour or two. So this is how it came out. The first one was not so dense, but this other one was very nice. It held together. Perhaps I will have given them some more time in the um, in the refrigerator. So this is how it was looking. This one was very crumbly. I think um, if I were asked, I will choose to add some more time. So this one was this one held shape very well. So I decided to begin with this one, and it was. It smelled nice. It smells nice. It is. Um, also doing nice here in the bread <laughs> I did not toast the bread but um, it was applying well just like the similar butters that you see on the stores and this one is sweet guys I think I like this one um, it is oil free that is the good advantage about it if you if you're oil free this recipe can work well for you maybe sometime later i'll 
try a recipe with oils um, and then we'll see how it goes so remember when you're eating this eat this to the glory of God remember to be a channel of light wherever the Lord has placed you if you like this recipe please give it a thumbs up tell me what you think um, I'll appreciate your feedback you can try it I love this one this one with coconut the white one I love it guys but don't take my word for it I would like you to try it um, for this other one I think I will have added some psyllium husks maybe I'll suggest that in the description box um, this white one I think I can use it in baking I'll try it out and then I'll let you know how it comes out Otherwise, have a blessed week. Bye.